Oh, this is really getting a list here. I didn't even have this number. Let's just look. Uh, so we have a lot to do today. I'm, I'm not going to talk about BABA today. You lot have to let it trade out. If you're still in the option, you let it trade out. It should hold today. So you got to, you got to, you either took the first move out or you're waiting for the second move. And we'll talk about it tomorrow. Personally, I don't even want to talk about it today. I don't want to look at it. You got to just hold the conviction. You know, it's all that you can do. Everything was in free fall yesterday because of the market. But I will tell you that I think the market holds. So I think it holds today. And I think we have a big move up tomorrow. We're just too close to hitting over to make a brand new all-time high in the QQQs not to do it. There's just no way we don't we don't do it. So if we would pull back down, it would be such a deep pullback. There'd be no way we'd hit up over the high anytime soon in the next month. So I just don't see that happening. I just don't see that happening at all. So I think it's more likely we hold. And today could just be a day of nothing. Fake lower, fake higher, not really go anywhere. End up closing today holding with the tail, kind of like yesterday, but not really going higher. <laughs> and then waiting for tomorrow, which tomorrow is, is soon, and tomorrow isn't until 10 o'clock when what's her face speaks. So, you know, expect a whip. So I think that we actually. I mean, a fake out in the market. I think we'll, people will think we're lower, but we're not. And then people think we're holding and we won't. I think we should just, this looks worse here. I think we should do one quick trade. One quick trade today and done and out. Like we normally would and we have plenty of things to do. I really wanted to do this, but I don't think it's happening. I just don't think it's, it just doesn't look right here now. Considering market. This is good, too. SIG is good as well, except for the fact that, you know, once again, this is going to have a big stop. Everything today, everything is today is going to have a big stop at HBQ. And I was going to do it, but I'm changing my mind as I'm sitting here. I'm changing my mind because it's too much volume and it doesn't look weak enough now for some reason. For some unknown reason. Okay, let's just watch DG. Let's make our lives easy. Does anybody want to look at anything else? I was going to watch two things, but, well, I guess I could put HPQ here. Mo, MOV didn't do anything for me. <laughs> too thin. Too thin on the day, too thin in the morning. No immediate play there. So too thin. I'm not sure what the reason for the gap was either, but right now you can't do it. It's way too thin. And this, is, this is just going to have a massive stop. It's going to be spreading. It's going to have a big stop. It's just, there's nothing else I can say here, people. Oops. here. I may not be crazy aggressive today. Let's just see. Unless this opens and swishes because this is a wild stock. I mean, these, this, these two today, the CG and the SIG are wild. Spready, but I mean, I put some big numbers in the room. That thing could go to $79 today. Something crazy. Or I mean, a DG. I mean, this one. They, these can go to some nutty numbers. Four, five, six dollar moves these stocks could have today. 83 is set in SIG, 79 on DG. Not anti this now. I just think it's just too. Don't like this here. And I think I'm going to watch the DG. I mean, I have HPQ in the middle, but I'm liking this less because I think it should be showing more weakness. 
this is just a personal opinion. It's not the rating. The rating is valid. The rating's valid on it. If it sets up, you can do it. It's here in the middle. But I'm telling you, I considering the volume in this is a lot. It's a lot. Okay. Yep, we're probably gonna do a crazy one today. Look, this is going right now. So I, I don't know how aggressive I'm gonna be because I, I'm not like jumping up and down to do a one minute low in DG. So just know that. And the resistance is 84. The resistance is really 84 and it's it's at 82.75, 82.50 now. Look, this is just going. Well, I'll see. I'm not like all over anything today. So I've got HPQ in the middle. I've got DG up in the big screen. I don't know which one I'm gonna do. I don't know if I'm doing anything. I don't wanna be aggressive with DG. These are both good gaps. I don't like the strength that this is showing here this morning with the volume. And I wanna get a play today, but here, look, this is going right now. Oh, jeez. Uh, every number I just gave you is wrong for this now. Look, it just it just broke again. No number I put in here is right now anymore. I was collapsing. Uh, the, the best thing this can do is go break immediately. That's the best thing this can do now, seeing this. It's breaking harder, but the best thing this can do is set up set up now aggressively, and that wasn't what I wanted to do with it. Here, let's just watch it. HPQ is in the middle. DG's up in the big board. It's gotten to several targets I put in the room, but it, it could still go. It's, it's, it's collapsing. Here. Hopefully, I'll have my charts fixed today. The guy did email me back yesterday, last night. Relax today, people. Be relaxed with everything. Be relaxed with BABA. Be relaxed with the market. Be relaxed with the trades that we do. Okay, 54, so spready. Now, we can do HPQ, we can do HPQ, hold on, wait. Let's do, now we have to wait, now we have to wait. We have to wait, 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 wait. Wait on everything, don't anybody be anything yet, just wait. Okay, we can do this. We can do this after all. The rating was good. Stop's going to be 70. I don't have the entry yet. Let's do 54 by 70. 54 by 70 HPQ. 54 by 70. If it hits. Oh, wait. Yeah, this can't go over the high. This just goes over the high, then we'll be off of it. Crap, we're not in anything yet. We're not in anything yet. Don't, don't, I said today, don't, 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 don't get nuts. Oh, this just broke right now and I didn't get it. It's just broke right now and I didn't get it, but it's wild. Here, DG, it's, I'm not in this and I didn't even have time to call it, let alone figure anything out. 82. Twenty-five. 
05 by 25. This is a dollar 25 cent stop, and it's just breaking. It's just going. I didn't. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. Gosh darn it. There's. It, you can do DJ, but the stop has to literally. It's just. This is just going. I didn't even have time to see it or do it or size myself. Stop has to be 82.25. Let's just see if I can find something to do for us. No, that just went too fast. No, don't do HPQ at all. JKS went, but not enough volume. Actually, this this isn't still going here right now. All right, I'm not at anything yet. I'm not at anything yet. I'm not at anything yet. I'm not at anything at all. What was the one from yesterday? What did we do? EXPR. Jeez, I have now the market's trying to hold. Did anybody do this? I didn't do it. I didn't do it, but it's 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 rallying again here now. I did absolutely nothing. We might get a chance to take it if it holds, and if it doesn't, you better have a stop in. I did not do it. It broke and fell hard, and now it's rallying again. I'm not in any trades yet today. And I said, don't jump the gun. That's what I said. 77, 77. We could do, this is not ideal. I'm back to the HPQ because I'm trying to find something to do. And I can't. I can't find anything to do. No, nope, this is flipping. Quickly, give me, a, give me an idea. Wait, write something in the room. Anything you want me to watch. The only thing that I see that fell right away is actually was JKS, and I did look at it, and I did rate it. As funny I said to Paul, this actually doesn't look half bad, but I don't like the volume in it. And I did not do it or call it or watch it or anything. And the market is, like I said, it's going to just fake out, fake out, fake, 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 fake. Try to go lower, try to go higher, fake itself everywhere around. Quickly, give me something to look at, because as of right now, I'm not in love with this and this. I'm not in love with any more either the way this acted. And none of these are fast plays. And that's what we do. MDT, no. Flipping, what happened with the move? No. Flipping, not enough volume. No, this isn't right. The only thing that looks right is Bab, but it's the only good news. Bab is holding. Where did it open? It's actually good news. Good news for once in our lives. Here, I've got nothing. Fuck yes. Give me a long. I mean, we've got time. It's 9.35. I'm not giving up on our day. But nothing is setting up right. You can't just, like, short into the wind. Give me an idea of somebody. Write something in the room. A long or short. Nothing here looks right right now. I don't even think this holds right. And we can still keep watching it. Eighty two twenty seven. Mew? Oh, well, I'm watching DG now, and it just broke hard, and I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't call this, but it's Mew. Is Mew gapping? I'm not in any trades right now. I'm in absolutely nothing. And DG is breaking, but You can call this if you want, Paul. I don't, I don't, I'm not crazy about this. If you want to get on the mic and call it, you can. I 
The only way I think I'd want to go long today is if we had a quality long. I didn't think we had the market against us today in any short, but I, I, don't, I don't think some of these things look good enough here. This even looked like it was going to collapse right now. It just didn't do it. I don't know if we can find a way in or not now. Let me just pay attention. Paul, if you want to go over Mew, you can get on the mic. Just hop on. Let's just see if this holds here. We could do stop could be 8175. 8175 will be the stop, but I don't have the entry. Let's do 99 by 75. And I'm telling you right now, this is a kamikaze. DG short, 99.75. It's a kamikaze. 99 by 75. I'll go over it later. I'm just trying to find a way in here. In case this breaks below, it's going to collapse, but I don't know if it does. 99 by 75. No, it's not doing it yet. No, no, no. Just got to wait. I'm not in anything yet. No, just, just wait. Wow. The only thing that fell was JKS. Okay, we'll do 85. 85 will be the stop if this hits. And I don't want to go long unless it looks amazing. I don't think me looks amazing. It could rally. Let's do 19 by 85. That's the smallest stop we're going to get in this. 19 by 85. 19 by 85, DG short. I so much happen when we get something in the daily. 19 by 85. And don't anyone jump into it unless you're already in it. Here, 19 by 85, you might get it. Nope, not yet. Nope, not yet. Just wait. Okay, we could do 20 by 85. Not much of a difference, but... I can't look at anything else right now because I think this might actually hit. And if I don't get this, I'm probably not going to get anything. So let's just wait. This is at 85. Let me just double check it. Let's give it 90. 90, 90, 90. 90, 90. 90 is a stop. 81, 90. 81, 90. Five more cents. You can be in. You can be in if you want to wait for the five minutes. Or you want to wait for 99, but I think that this breaks. I think this breaks and I gave it enough room. And this is the best stop we're going to get in this. This is it. It's either do or die. If this doesn't go here, it's not going to work. I think that it goes. I think it goes. It was a good gap. I hate the open, though. Really, really do. But if this breaks below, it's going to collapse. It's 80-70. This is worth it. This is worth it because of the fact that it actually here. Here, here let's look at the market. Wow. And market's holding. Market's holding, and this is trying to go. Here, the only thing that possibly that even made any sense anymore. The HBQ I'll look at later. I just don't like the way it ended up looking. And I didn't didn't even get this. This just fell out of the sky here. But you, you could be in this with a stop over the high, but I don't think that makes any sense anymore. Here. Okay, we're getting something. What did I say? Target. Every target I made is the wrong. 80, 50, 80, 60, 80, 50, 80 dollars, 80, 70, 79. I mean, 79 dollars, which I can't see myself ever holding that to there. 
Yeah, you got to be in it. You got to be in it. You could have been in it already, but I never even called that first move. It just broke too early. But it was a good guess. 80 50. No, it did not break the whole number yet. So you have to kind of wait a little. 81. Here. All right. Excellent. Here we go. Here it goes. Here. Once it breaks 81, it should break the low. Did it do it yet? No? No, 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 no. But it's right there. Hanging like a beautiful angel. Let's just double check the stop. Excuse me. <coughs> Choking now. No, I'm not moving the stop. Shoot. Here it goes. All right, who's in what? Did anybody do the mew? You could have done the mew, I guess. I have to look at it. I just I just wanted I wanted a short today. I didn't think we here. So I almost, I almost just said screw the day because I'm so impatient. I'm the most impatient person on the planet. Nope, we didn't get under 81 yet. Journey Woman's in it. Duvaz is in it. Trader Lux is in it. Will's in it. FI, I'll look at that later. But we got to pay attention here now because this did not break the whole number yet. Now if it didn't. It did not. <sighs> wow, this is here. Let's blow it up. Eighty one, eighty one oh five. Make sure you have your stop in. I still think this this is uh, this is actually I still like it, but it didn't break yet, and I thought it would. I thought, yeah, here. This is going to collapse though so if it breaks. Here it goes. Well, this was hard, people. This wasn't easy. It wasn't an easy morning, and we kind of knew it anyways that it wasn't. And the market is holding, and the market is holding, and Babbitt is holding, and and. And we're in a short, so that's all we can do. So you have to know what you're doing with this. Through the low, it should drop a dollar. I mean, let's just, just see if we can try to hold it to 80 bucks. I think we could get there quickly. But this this has a just a giant mungo target now because it, you see how people are trying to buy it. Hey, let's just go over it. Let's just go over it because it'll help some of you to stay with the tree. I did not like the shelf, and I wasn't crazy. Here, here. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> this is such a hard call. I'm right. <gasps> Look, it's going to break the low. Get that right <laughs> We're in the right direction, though. Oh, my Atlanta. People are trying to buy this on the 200 period moving average, but it's not, it's not along. But we went for the confirmation. I didn't want to take this here. I did not want to. Didn't break 81 yet. Look. It's gonna, here it goes. Wow, so hard today. Tomorrow we should get something easy. Actually, yesterday was easy. The day before was easy. <sighs> here it goes, it's gonna break. This is a, this is a, here, here it goes, it's gonna break. So many traders wanna buy stocks on support on the 200 premium moving average. What a professional play for me to call this short and even do it. Even at this price point today. It's red. It's red on the day, and the market's green. This was a really, really nice call. You got to stay with it, though. So let's just go over it. Let's just go over it, since some of you are probably like, oh. Somebody in here is probably long in it, because I'm doing it up at house today. But it's, it's a short. Here it goes. It's going to break 81. Let's watch it. It should just collapse. Low is 80, 70. <gasps> Actually, the spread's thinned out. Sig? Sig? Did Sig work? I didn't
didn't like the rallying of that. We can go over that. That's more your play, Art Squared. I hate those rallies. Here, there it goes. Vindication. Oop, wait, it didn't break. Well, well. Here, you could get on top of this here if it doesn't break 70, but I'm certain that it does. You could have done both. You probably could have done SIG and DG. Let's just look at HVQ quick while this is falling. No, this just didn't do anything right here today. Here. Yeehaw, are we at a square dance? <laughs> Squared said yeehaw. <laughs> Boop. All right, hand in the button. He knows if it doesn't break an amount. It can literally go right there, so pay attention. Then we'll go over it. Look, it's going to go right down. Yay. Oh, this is going to collapse now. This is going to absolutely collapse. Look at the market. Wow, for the market to hold in a gap down like this on a day after yesterday and not to have a fall through on the sell off yesterday is a sign of bullishness. It's a sign of bullishness. No one believes me, but it is. It's actually a sign of bullishness for the market to do that today, to hold in the gap. It's a very good sign of bullishness. We open at 75. There's just too many things going on in my mind at once. Let me just look at Facebook quickly. Oh my gosh, it takes too long. Hurry, hurry. What a nice trade. Woo, who do we think we are? All right, Matt, now I'm reinvigorated to go over BABA after this, but we're not out of it yet. Uh, 68, we only broke the low by two cents. Look, someone will try to buy this here. Here it goes. A fig, yeah, fig, somebody else wrote the room fig. I'm not in it though. I'm in this one, so I have to pay attention. But I, I you could have done them both. Eighty-sixty-six. Really hard to do both of these though. They're very expensive, and you know, you get, you really got to watch these stocks. Both expensive and both spready. Would have been hard to do both, but you could have. Did anyone do both? I doubt it. Some people did one, some people did the other. Here, DJ. Hand of the button. She's on to the right now. Done. Dead. Here it goes. It's going to go right down. Yay. Well, this is a nice call. Here, here we're going to get it. It might even break 80. This is a good day for people around the world. Here we go. 80, 30. Look, it's just selling off. Nice. Wow, it's probably going to go to 79 today. I'll never see that number, though, unless it goes right now. <laughs> I said 79 this morning, too. Here it is. And you better just, oh, no. No. 8021. Crap, hold on. One more pushing them out of this. One more pushing them out of this. Come on. Come on. Okay, she's sitting forever. No, not yet. 21, 47. Nine fifty one. Here. In fact, not 
Here, no, it's going to go. Here it goes. Here it goes. This is it. I'm just no more patience. And you could put the stop over 8050 if you really wanted to be tight. There it is. This is a nice trade. I'm not going to let this get over 20, though. Come on, just go. Oh my gosh, look at this, just go. I'm out, I can't stand it, I can't stand it anymore. Here, no, it just broke. I took it, I took it, took it, took it, I'm not gonna hold it through a rally for 10 cents. I was gonna get out of 80 anyways. Here, if you're still in it, you could put the stop at 80.50 or 80.20 or 80.30 or whatever you want to do. I'm done. Nice trade. Uh, let's look at this. Okay, so again, what did I say this morning? Market's going to fake. Fake lower, fake higher, fake, 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 fake. So we fake higher, we fake lower, fake higher, fake lower now. That's what we're doing. It's a fake, fake, fake day. Don't expect fall through lower. Don't expect fall through higher. That's exactly what I said. Fake, fake, fake. The only good thing really about Baba today is the open. The open actually was 75, so that was actually very good. So the stock actually opened at 93.75 above above the low from yesterday, which I really wanted it to. So this actually did do one good thing for itself today, and it was it got down with the market. Uh, what did this do? Oops. Wow, yeah, this collapsed too. Everything did. This went to 79. I said 79 for the other. All of these had huge targets. I told you that this morning. Massive target. Stop on this was a dollar plus. Uh, this probably I probably would have given it a buck and a half. A buck and a half here. So let's just look. It doesn't matter. Huge trade. This is like five R, six, something like that. Probably would have got out right around in here. Probably a dollar and a half stop I would have done. I did not like the rally. I did not like the rally, but it did hold 88. That was the last number I gave for the resistance, 88. You could have done this, and you could have done this. And here, where did this end up going? Oh, good exit on this. Six hours, yep. Nice trade. But hard to do both. Very expensive and very spready and big stops and everything. All right, who wants to go over what? There's nothing we can do with this today until we see how it closes. You're obviously, if you hung through it yesterday, you're staying with the trade. I think going back, the one thing I realized is that, you know, there's, this is a lot of money to make very quickly, and that for it to make a second move, which I'm anticipating it doing, you have to wait. And I don't know if I have the patience anymore. 
I don't know if I have the patience anymore to wait. It's something that I've considered now and I have to consider for further trade. But there's nothing wrong with the chart. It still looks good. More than two weeks out in the option that I'm in, and it's holding. So it's pulled back. The market collapsed yesterday, and this fell in a gap down today. But the chart is still strong, and it's good. And one good thing is I also have a good price in it up here at 95. So you have to decide what you're wanting to do with this. But, you know, if you were to stay with it, then you're following it through. If you want to get out of it, the day was here or any of these days in here or even yesterday you could have got outbreak even. And I was going to, and then I said, you know what, there's nothing wrong with it. So I put the risk on and I'm holding it through. And I believe the market actually has a big rally tomorrow, which it's been waiting to do. So this probably really was, again, the sell-off people wanted to see instead of a pullback. Because where are we going to pull back? We'd, pull, we'd have to pull back to some crazy level, and I just don't see that happening. We would, we would make such a retracement if we fell past this point that the market would not, uh, would not look good from being so close to the previous high. So the fall and drop will be big if we would pull all the way down to another level. We had a, we had a straight sell-off yesterday, straight sell-off. <laughs> but the overall chart of the market is still extremely strong. So I just don't see us pulling back something something crazy. I think we have econ tomorrow morning before the market. And I think we also have the Yellen speech. Here, this is still going. I said 79. I'm all out of it. You could still be in it. Beautiful short. Great call. Great call. Let's quickly go over the, let's quickly go over the DJ. And I, and I did not, wasn't crazy about the open. And I didn't want to be aggressive on this, so I wasn't, so I waited. I didn't even do this here. It broke too hard to even figure out any, any sizing or call it. But then I, we, we inched our way in. I did a great job in assigning us an entry. So we did it. We did it. It's still going, but I'm out. And this was a real expert play. This is the kind of thing I do so well. A lot of people probably were looking to buy this. You can see people here were trying to buy the double bottom, buy it over the high, buy it in here, and buy it on support. But it's it's not a long, it's a short, and I know from the gap rating. This rated 20 points today. It was a valid short. And, and we did it. We did it. We had a nice move. And I think we had a better stop that we could have possibly ever had because uh, I was expecting a very large stop on this and the SIG. SIG had a large stop but had a bigger move, but the stop was big. I don't know what the spread was in here in the open. I think I would have given it at least a dollar half. Nice moves and everything today here, finally, but late. Okay. Nice, nice trade. I mean, great call. Still going. Is anyone still in this? Look, this is crazy. 79. 79.50, 79. This is no let up here now, but you know, you got to get out somewhere. Who is doing what in this? Is anyone still in this? Uh, Trader Lexi Paul has having a, somebody's going to lecture this morning. Uh, someone's going to lecture this morning about something. And I didn't look at your, your email yet. I will look at it today and email you. Maybe we can jump in the room later today or, or, or sometime after the lecture. I forgot that Paul has a lecturer person coming today named Alan about the scanner. Will is still in DG. Anyone else? Oh my goodness, look here. 7950. Is Will the only one still in this? Mew worked? Alan's 1045. All right, let me try to here, Mew did work. Here, Paul, why don't you go over Mew? Uh, let me pull up uh, Trader Lexi's email because I have to look at that email to even see your question. Why don't I'll pull that up? Maybe I can go over that with her in here if he doesn't talk till 1045. But here, you go over the meal. Let me pull up her email, and then we'll then we'll go go from there. Wow, this is still going. Good job, everybody. Great job, everyone today. Spark is still in it too. Trader Lexi, hold on. Maybe I can still go over it now. But Paul's going to get on the mic. Let me look for the email. This is still going. That's crazy. Yay.